can high voltage damage your air conditioner? Spoiler alert, yes, it can, and you want to avoid it, so let's talk about why. So, your air conditioner is designed to run within a specific voltage range. When the voltage goes too high, it can cause some serious problems. First up is the compressor. This is the heart of your AC, and when the voltage spikes, it can overheat and burn out. And trust me, you don't want to be dealing with a broken compressor, it's expensive to fix or replace. Then, there are the electrical components. Things like capacitors, relays, and circuit boards, they're super sensitive to voltage changes. Too much voltage? Boom. Fried. And suddenly, your AC is not working as it should, or even worse, not working at all. Another thing that can happen is insulation breakdown. Inside the AC, the wiring has insulation to keep things safe, but with high voltage, that insulation can get damaged, leading to short circuits, or worse, electrical fires. Not good. But don't worry, there's a simple way to protect your air conditioner from all this. Use a voltage stabilizer or surge protector. These handy devices help keep the voltage stable and prevent any damage before it happens. When choosing a stabilizer, you want to ensure it's suitable for your air conditioner's voltage and power rating. Here's what to look for. First, check the voltage rating of your AC. Most air conditioners run on 220 to 240 volts, so make sure the stabilizer can handle that range. Second, consider the power rating, or KVA, of the stabilizer. For a typical home air conditioner, you'll need a stabilizer rated for around 1.5 to 5 kVA angst, depending on the tonnage of your AC. A 1.5 ton AC would usually need a stabilizer rated for at least 3 kVA If you're unsure, always go for a slightly higher rating to be on the safe side. This way, your stabilizer can handle any sudden voltage spikes without straining. So that's it for today. Make sure to keep your AC protected and save yourself from costly repairs. If you found this helpful, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe for more electrical tips and tricks.